Well, good morning, everyone. Pastor Corey Rowan here with Yorksville First Midvale and Newport United Methodist Church, bringing you a devotional today out of the book of Malachi, and it's Malachi 1, verse 1. And it says, The burden of the word of the Lord to Israel by Malachi. And I, I like this first phrase here, the burden of the word of the Lord. And I, I don't think Malachi is saying this to say that it is a burden to bring the word of God. I think Malachi is saying this because the, the word of God does does create some kind of responsibility for us to carry it does it, the if if you have been given the word of god if you have if you know the word of god if you believe the word of god especially if god has called you to preach that word to others, it's not necessarily the word itself is burdensome, but the task is very burdensome. The task is one that is not to be taken lightly. The task is one that needs to be carried out, and it can be a burden because what Malachi was doing for the people of Israel is he was telling them things that they did not want to hear. Often the word of God is full of things that people necessarily don't want to hear, uh, and, and but it is it is our burden, it is our responsibility, I guess is another word, to tell them. It's our responsibility to correctly give, to correctly preach and teach the word of God because if we do not, if Malachi for some reason decided that he'd only want to preach a good message and not anything bad, then he would be going against God, then he would be disappointing God, and then he would be judged even more harshly because he did not give a correct, a correct message from the Lord. There is a burden for all Christians, a burden for anyone that loves Jesus, a burden for anyone who knows Jesus to give a correct message preaching and give a correct interpretation of the word of God to witness for God and to and to hold the Bible up as the truth that it is as as uh, as it is talked about in scripture rightly dividing the word of God we cannot whitewash the word we cannot only bring messages that people want to hear because that's not what the Bible gives us we have the burden to bring the word of God the whole word of God because that is the only thing that will help this world we cannot help anyone we cannot save souls by whitewashing or by washing down the Bible it can we can only bring the message of repentance through the through the whole Bible. We can't leave parts out just because just because people might not agree with them or it might not offend some. To to water down the gospel, to water down the Bible is one of the most dangerous things we can do because the Bible is the only way for people to know the true God. And so if we are watering down the Bible, then we are not giving people the true God. We are giving them a, a message that we have created, a message that 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 comes from us and not from the Lord. And so my message to you today is remember the burden of the word. And the burden of the word is to give the correct word, to give the true word, to give the whole Bible to the world, because that is what they need. Amen.